And money is no longer an issue for people in Durham when it comes to bailing out of jail. A new Durham County bail policy went into effect today, changing considerations for pretrial release. CBS 17's Derek Lewis is digging deeper into that policy and talking to the judge who signed off on it. A capital murder defendant can get arrested today in Durham and walk the streets tomorrow. Well, the public might not like it, but that's the purpose of pretrial release. Superior Court Judge Orlando Hudson worked with Chief District Court Judge Pat Evans to change Durham's pretrial release policy, including reducing secured bonds for felonies. We now know through studies that have been done that that's not the reason people show up for court because they put up a cash bond. Magistrates have new guidelines for bonds in Durham. They will now consider whether a person is a threat to the community instead of how much money they can pay. The previous policy did not de-emphasize cash bonds. The purpose is to ensure defendants will show up to court. Hudson tells me there are ways to make that happen, such as notifying defendants of their court dates and using GPS tracking devices. He says a defendant has a presumption of innocence. The state has the burden of proof of showing um, in some type of hearing why a certain bond is necessary and a defendant doesn't have that proof. In Durham, I'm Derek Lewis, CBS 17 News.